Hi, and welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to Costco. That's right, and we're taking you guys along with us. Now in two days, it's Miss Lily's birthday, and I have nothing planned. We need to pick up food, and I don't even know what kind of food we're gonna get. So, I've got my coupons, I've got my notebook, and hopefully we can decide on the way to Costco. Are you ready? Yeah! Let's go! Let's go! The family fudge, the family fudge. They are mostly sweet but full of nuts. Okay, so we just made it to Costco, and it doesn't look too crowded, which is awesome. And I sort of have my list going. I think we're gonna do hot dogs for the kids, mini hamburger sliders for the adults, a green salad, a fruit salad, some chips, dip, and then I still have to figure out what to do about the birthday cake. I don't know if I wanna buy one or if I wanna make one, I'm not sure, but let's head on in. What are you guys doing? <laughs> it's really hot today. I was hoping it was like boot weather, but it's not, it's really hot. Are you guys ready to go in? Yeah. Okay guys, now every time we go in the store, we say the rules, right? Yeah. yeah. But, if you know what the rules are, please leave a comment down below. I know. We've said the rules so many times, I bet one or two of you know what they are. Let us know if you do. Now let's go. Yeah! I'm seriously considering getting season passes to Universal this year instead of Disney because these are only 119 which is a lot cheaper than Disney. I don't know, what do you think, Kenzie? I want to go here. I'm starting to read the books. Yes, I want to go to Harry Potter World so bad. So Mackenzie and I took a break to go to the bathroom and now we cannot find our group. We can't find our family. They're missing. <laughs> they couldn't have left us here though. Let's yeah. keep looking. There they are. We found them. I was looking for you. Are you crying? Are you crying? You want to get out? Okay, you can get out. I think I found the deal of the day. These big juice boxes have like one big juice inside and it's organic fruit juice with no added sugar and organic and it's only 97 cents. That is super cheap. Like why is that so cheap? I think I might get this and then mix this with some Sprite and have some really yummy punch for the birthday party. Check it out you guys, the new Pioneer Woman cookbook. I'm such a big fan of hers. This is an awesome book. I actually don't have this one yet. They have a lot of cool kitchen gadgets right now. Perfect for holiday baking. Check out this set of Pyrex pie pans or pie dishes. You get three of them and they're really nice and deep. And it's only $9.99. And check out the bakeware set. This is $19.99 and it comes with three different wavy shaped casserole dishes. And they have a blue one and they have a white one as well. Very nice. And for the bakers in your life, this would make a perfect gift. This Wilton set has five pieces and it's only $30. This is such a good deal. $14.99 for some stainless steel measuring cups and spoons. These are so nice because they're made from Chicago Metallic. So I've actually worked with this company before and they are awesome. <laughs> Kenzie found a book she likes. I'm already starting to read these. There's a whole new series. Ooh, you know, it's almost your birthday and Christmas. Would you like to get those for your birthday? Yeah. For Christmas? Yeah. I'll check out my friend here. He's on clearance for only $24.99. This is so cuddly. I have one too. Okay, so we're almost ready to go, but Lily wants to show us her birthday twirl. Show us. 
Oh, beautiful. Let's go. Okay, guys, so I'm finally back home now, and as you can probably tell, it's nighttime, like almost bedtime for the kids late. We ended up leaving Costco, we got home, I dropped off the kids and my husband and all of the Costco stuff, and then I went to the grocery outlet by myself. So before I show you everything that I got, I'll show you my favorite item that I got. And I wasn't planning on getting it, I didn't want to get it, but I did want to get it at the same time. But it was my husband who actually ended up putting it in the cart, and it is the cookbook, the new Pioneer Woman cookbook. And this one's actually called the Come and Get It book because all of the recipes in here are supposed to be easy and quick and that sort of thing. So now I've got two of these. We've got quite the collection going on, but I love the Pioneer Woman, so I was excited to get this book. So I'll go ahead and show you everything that I got right now. Okay, friends, so mostly food items today. We didn't need detergent or any paper products. Now we did get a lot of party foods and some items that you don't normally see on my table. But I'll go ahead and start back here with the things from Costco. First up, I have two boxes of these lentils. These are one of my favorite quick and easy lunch items, and they're actually on sale right now, so I picked up two boxes. I also got a thing of olives. My kids love olives, and lots of veggies. Over here, I have the kale salad. I haven't had this in a while, so that sounded really good. And then I also picked up another package of the Asian cashew chopped salad. I love both of these, but I think this one would be my favorite. So one of these I'll probably end up serving at the birthday party, and the other one I'll eat just by myself over a couple of days, of course. Over here I picked up another big bag of broccoli and a watermelon. Now for Miss Lily's birthday, she requested fruit salad. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this in half take the watermelon out, and then use half of the watermelon rind as the bowl. Now I will have to go back to the store and pick up strawberries and blueberries and probably grapes, but I don't want to get those until Saturday. So we just got the watermelon today. Back here I got some almond milk, and then the deal of the day. Well, I'm hoping they're the deal of the day because they were really cheap. These are big boxes of juice, so no added sugar organic not from concentrate juice, and these were only 97 cents for this box, so hopefully it's good. I'm not quite sure, but I'm gonna turn this into some punch for our birthday party. Now over here I picked up something that I've been looking at for a while, but never tried. Now I love yakisoba normally, but I've never tried this one. So this is an all vegetarian Japanese style stir fried noodles with, vegetable, with vegetables and sauce. So this package has six in here, and I think this was about $10, so hopefully it's good. That was a little bit pricey for me. Then my husband picked up these. This is the millet and brown rice ramen. He's a big fan of this. He likes to make some soup. And we also picked up to go with it some better than bouillon, but this is actually the vegetable one. We have the chicken one already and it's really good, so I can't wait to try the vegetable one. Moving back over here, I picked up another package of the French crepes. The kids loved these, and they're still only $4.99, so I picked up another package of those, and some more hot dogs. Lily loves hot dogs, so we're gonna have those at the birthday party with some cheeseburger sliders that I'm going to make with all of this beef here, so hopefully that'll be enough for our large crowd. And then my husband picked up steak, which we don't normally buy. I'm not a huge fan of steak, um, but he is, so he picked up these. Speaking of what the husband put in the cart, he also put some bacon in our cart. Again, I don't eat a lot of bacon, not that there's anything wrong with bacon, but uh, yeah, he picked up this. <laughs> I also got a thing of butter, and bananas and a big thing of tortilla chips. I'm hoping to make some dip to go with this. I almost bought it from the store, but I really would like to make my own. So hopefully I can do that. We also got this big box of pumpkin spice quick bread mix. Now this was $9.99, but it comes with four individual packages, so it makes a lot. And they were actually sampling these as pancakes at Costco today, and all the kids ate one and they loved them. So. I was happy to pick that up. Now to go on our mini cheeseburger sliders, I picked up a package of this cheese. This is a variety pack with cheddar and Swiss and Havarti and Gouda. Now I love all of these cheeses. Let me know in the comments down below what is your favorite kind of cheese. 
for cheeseburgers. Moving over here, I picked up a package of the Purdue popcorn chicken. Now this looks pretty good. It doesn't have any antibiotics. It says it's all natural, no filler, so not too bad. And this is actually on sale right now too. To go with our hot dogs, I got a big thing of buns. Now, whatever we don't end up using for the birthday party, I will go ahead and freeze, and then we'll use them for lunches and other things. To go with our burgers, however, I picked up some Hawaiian rolls. This is a lot of Hawaiian rolls. I got two double packs because I didn't want to run out, and just like the hot dog buns, with whatever's left over, we'll stick in the freezer. I think the last thing from Costco is under here. I got a double pack of the Sara Lee um, whole grain white bread. Um, they were sampling this as well, and the kids really liked it, and it was pretty cheap, so we picked that up. And now I think we're on to the things from the grocery outlet. Now, if you're new here, the grocery outlet is similar to an Aldi, but not quite as good. First, I picked up a bag of bows. This is for Miss Lily's birthday party. And then I also picked up some hair ties. I thought those were really pretty colors and only a dollar. I also picked up a block of cream cheese and some pepper jack cheese to hopefully make that dip that I was hoping to make. I also got some Parmesan cheese, some onions, and some pears. Miss Lily really wanted some pears, and I knew that if I waited and got them at the grocery outlet instead of Costco, that they would be a lot cheaper. So I got those, and they actually look really good. Back here, I picked up two frozen dinners for myself. This is the Thai-style ginger beef, and these are really good and surprisingly gluten-free as well. And they had these on sale for two for $3, which is a really good deal. I also picked up two bottles of Sprite. This is gonna go with our fruit juice over there for our um, party punch. And then I asked Lily what she wanted to have for breakfast on her birthday, and this is what she picked. So I'm okay with it. It's her birthday after all. I also picked up a bag of potatoes. I'm hoping to do a baked potato bar um, one night for dinner this week. And some green onions. And then I was really excited to find this because I'd like to make my own hummus. This is some tahini, which is sesame seed um, butter. And then there's this guy. And yes, this is for me. I know it's bad, but I like it occasionally. But this is definitely one of my favorites. This is mochi ice cream. If you've never had this, it is really good. I love all things mochi in general, but this actually has uh, ice cream inside. And mochi is just like a pounded sweet rice dough. It's really good. I also picked up some mushrooms. And then I think the last thing that I picked up are these, which sound really weird, I know. It's real banana flavored milk. So if you hate bananas, you would definitely not like this. But I know my kids will like it. Um, it's similar to something we find when we are in Utah, flavored milk. And so I thought this would be a fun addition to a school lunch. And these were four for a dollar, so a really good deal. Okay friends, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.